So score view is different than piano roll for several reasons, but I'm not gonna name those right now. You're gonna have to watch. So there's a couple more things that we can do within the score view, which is uh, manipulate the pitch and the velocity, which are other parameters that we can do within the regular piano roll of uh, MIDI editing. So let's take a look at that. Now, if we wanted to adjust the pitch, um, you can simply do one note, or you can simply do multiple notes, or all the notes. And I believe it's the same thing if you do not click on any of the notes. And you can simply slide the pitch slider up or down, and it'll raise the pitch up or down. Now, what is pitch? Well, pitch is obviously raising up the notes or keys up or down. Now what's kind of cool about the score view, I kind of do it just for fun sometimes, is when you slide the pitch, like I said before, it's essentially you're raising the key or the notes up or down. So visually, the score view shows the notes sliding up or down and automatically uh, transcribes them or transposes them for you. So it's cool. Let's, let's take a look at that. See how it's just like automatically transposing them into uh, the written classical view of notation. So that's cool. I like that. But um, let's, uh, let's rewind this back. Put the pitch back to zero to where it originally was. And let's take a listen, and then I will slide the pitch just to give you a reference. Okay, so that's how it normally sounds. We'll rewind this back. And let's raise up the pitch a little bit, just so it sounds funky. Okay, and if we wanted to go really, really low, we can go a lot lower than zero. Okay, so that's pretty cool. So please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. And if you have any requests, please send them to request at mahalo.com. Well, I do remember the time, the time we spent on my roof just staring.